Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to tonight's RTC TV4 broadcast, where your cast and comments are hosting the 4 and O Laville Lancers. I'm Blair Zimmerman, and I uh, I may be flying solo here tonight. Uh, I think that uh, my co-commentator got an opportunity to go watch some Purdue football, and I can't entirely say that I blame him for taking that opportunity. So if you will stay with me here this evening, uh, we will... We will check out how this game goes here tonight. John Harrell prediction is a LaVille victory. Of course, LaVille ranked in 2A football. Um, so definitely some stiff competition. Uh, predicted score for the night, 35-10 in LaVille's favor. And uh, I, I really hope that we can see the Comets put together some drives like we saw last week against Pioneer. Uh, now that said, uh, the freshman Cameron McFatridge is still out after that knee injury that he took uh, during the game last week. Comets lined up to receive, and we are ready to get underway here tonight. Balls up and deep. Comet's just going to let that roll into the end zone. Take possession a little bit further into their own territory. Comets lined up under center. Fumbled snap. Molenkov believe he was able to cover that, but not the way the Comets want to start their first possession. And tackled behind the line of scrimmage for a loss of yards. Brings the comet the comets to three and thirteen with the ball in their own seventeen yard line. And it looks like the ball was blown dead right back to the line of scrimmage. Comets now fourth and long on their own 17. <clears throat> Comets are out in a kick formation. Good snap to the kicker. Kick is high and pretty short. Caught by number 14, uh, Xavier Lefebvre on the Comets 40. And there is a flag in the backfield. Moving. 
penalty is against the receiving team. They'll uh, lose five yards on the original spot here. And the ball will be on the 44-yard line. Still in Comets territory. Lancers on the line in the gun. We've got a running play, finds a hole. Gonna move the chains, goes for the far sideline before being tackled at the Comets 10 yard line. Ball carrier there was Cody Allen. And the freshman Landon Rigney with that tackle. And you'll have to excuse me, that tackle was actually made on the 14-yard line. <clears throat> There's a snap. Allen, once again, looking for that same hole. Not able to find it the same way he did last time. Does make some positive yardage. Landon Rigney again with that stop. Second and three, ball on the eight yard line. Ball's coming out to the left and he will break the plane of the goal. Excuse me, the goal line. Just over three minutes gone and LaVille with points on the board. Lavelle going for the extra point. And the kick is up. And it's good. Well, after the Comets kick it away for to prevent a turnover on downs deep in their own territory, Laville comes back and puts seven on the board with 8.46 left here in the first. We're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Casting Comments Football here on RTC TV4. Hello. Apologize, we had some technical difficulties. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, LaVille's Lucas Plummer puts that kickoff deep. Comets will take possession back on their own 15-yard line. Thomas with 15 seconds on the play clock. Back in the gun. We're going to pass off to the left. Looks like a gain of a yard or two. Number seven, Yarbrough, the ball carrier. Tackled by number 75, Eric Bedock. And Yarber ta or yeah, Yarber tackled over here on the left side. Gets the ball back to the line of scrimmage before going down. Okay, 
And we've got a flag on that play. <laughs> Officials discussing the call out on the field. So we did have an illegal motion call against the Comets. All right, Comets now fourth and eight. And that kick is up and nearly into the stands. Very short kick. The Lancers will retake possession deep in Comets territory. Lancers take possession specifically on the Comets 30 yard line. Fakes the handoff, short pass, and great tackle there by Jabez Yarber. Just prevents movement of those chains as the Lancers will take second and one on the Comets 21 yard line. Plummer passing again, and that pass is complete in the end zone. Is Arnecki the receiver on that? Lancers back for the PAT. Kick is up. And good between the uprights. Just over half of the first quarter gone. LaVille's lead the Comets 14 to nothing. We'll be back after these words from our sponsors here on RTC TV4. You won this year's chili cook-off. Our girls played in the softball finals last spring. You're not just another policyholder to us. We remember your name. Hi, Cheryl. He remembered my name. Because it's your name. That's simple human sense. Ask the Jennings Insurance Agency in Argus and Rochester if auto owners make sense for you. Jeff, Mary, Dan, Sarah. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Teams are taken to the field. LaVille to kick off. Number nine, 
Lucas Plummer to kick off for the Lancers. Back deep to receive the comments. Number 21, Grant Yaden. Yaden and Yarber back deep to receive this kickoff from Plummer. <laughs> Kick is up, and that's going to go deep for the touchback. Comets taking over on their 20 yard line. Molenkov handing off to Yarber, who will fumble the ball deep behind the line of scrimmage. Xavier Lefebvre with that tackle. I really wasn't sure that Yarber was the one who ended up covering up that football. And the Comets will take their first timeout of the game. So we're going to step away for a word from our sponsors. You're watching Cast of Comets Football on RTC TV. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Comet second and 11. And Comet's still struggling to make any kind of positive gain of yardage. And LaVille will cover up that uh, fumble. Lancer's back for a pass. Plummer going to keep it himself. Finds a hole. Nearly makes it into the end zone. Just short. Plummer with an eternity back in the pocket. Didn't see any eligible receivers, so he moved it himself. Takes the ball down to the one-yard line. Lancers first and goal, one to go. Plummer with the short pass into the end zone. It's complete. <laughs> Plumber back for the PAT. And kick blocked by the Comets. Well, with 3.57 left in the first, LaVille leads 20 to zero. You're watching Casting Comments Football on RTC TV4. And welcome back. 
Lancers have swapped out kickers. They now have uh, Brandon Netrauer back to kick. Still a flat long kick. And it's going to go out of bounds. Penalty on that kick. So that illegal kicking procedure will be good to start the Comets at the 35-yard line. That was a great situational awareness there by Grant Yaden to go ahead and let the ball roll out instead of trying to scramble to snag it up. Some good positive yardage there. That was Kyle Raudebush making some forward progress. That'll be enough to move the chains for the first time this evening for the Comets. Ball moved forward to their own 45 yard line. Quick penetration there by the defense to take Molenkoff down three yards behind the line of scrimmage. Comet second and 13 on their own 42. And Comets will take their second timeout. So we'll be back after we stop to thank our sponsors. You're watching Cast of Comets Football here on RTC TV 4. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. There's the snap. Handoff is to Routabush. He keeps his feet, and he's going to be able to move the, uh, move the chains and a penalty on there. I'm gonna guess that that was that was a face mask penalty. So that'll be good for 15 yards. Put the comments on the Lancers 28 yard line. This could be the rally that the Comets need. From what we've seen so far this season, they absolutely have the chops to get in here and be big. They've got to believe in themselves. Good tackle breaks. Oh, and the ball carrier down well behind the line of scrimmage. Looks like he lost his footing. Landon Rigney carrying that ball. Comets now second and 16 with the ball in the Lancers 34. Coming up on the two minute warning here in this first quarter. Comets working the ball forward. Route a bush on that carry. Injury Officials calling the trainer out. Routabush is still down. And he's able to get to the feet, his feet under his own power. Walk off of the field. Looks like he's shaking his head saying he's okay. Thank you. 
All right, Comets third and eight. Ball on the 26 yard line. 27, I can count. They need to snap that ball. There it is. Oh, and a fumble on the tackle. Yarber able to cover it up. Unfortunately, covered well behind the line of scrimmage. Looks like we're back to fourth and 15, fourth and 16, somewhere in there. I'm going to go with the scoreboard. Fourth and 15. Thomas going to go ahead and go for it. And Routabush again with some good positive yardage. Unfortunately, not enough to move the chains. So LaVille will take possession in their own territory uh, for the first time this evening with just under a minute to go here in the first quarter. There's a snap, Plummer with the slant route. Great tackle there by number 16, Landon Rigney. Second down. 26 seconds left in the game clock for the quarter. LaVille will have to take one more snap before the quarter break. There it is. Pass off. Route to the... Oh, wow. Great tackle. Great tackle there by Grant Yaden. Deep behind the line of scrimmage. And so as we close out the first quarter, LaVille, uh, third and about 14, we're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Cast and Comets Football here on RTC TV. All right, going into the second quarter here, Comets taking the field with a 20-point deficit. But a great defensive rally going on right at the end of the first there. Have LaVille in a third and long situation in their own territory, and just outside of their own red zone. <laughs> Plumber back looking for the pass, sends it up. Yarber, oh, Yarber can't quite get there. Long pass to uh, number two, Colin Zarnecki. Well, more than enough to move the chains. I hear the rest of the guys up here in the press box saying they miss that hold. Oh, but they're going to call a penalty on that tackle. Looks like that might be Ashton Boyer who made that tackle. Oh, 
excuse me, nope, that's a 20. That's Gage Maneer. He was a little slow getting up. Got to his feet. We're going to have to see what the penalty flag is. It's like Coach Ulrich trying to uh, explain to the referee that they missed a hold before the flag they threw. Call that a blindside block against the Lancers. We'll move the ball backwards. Lancers now first and 15 just inside of Comets territory. Ball on the Comets 44 yard line. Plummer sends the ball, passes incomplete. Plumber back, thinks about passing, delays too long, gets tackled way behind the line of scrimmage. Lancer's now third in a parking lot. Looks like about 10 and, tw or uh, excuse me, third and 28. I reserve the right to have not been able to count that correctly though. Plummer drops back, short pass, floats over the top. Hits his receiver, who's finding a couple holes, gets tackled just inside the original line of scrimmage by number 19, Kyle Routabush. This might be the first fourth down situation the Lancers have faced here tonight, as they are fourth and 10. And it looks like the Lancers will use their first time out of the evening. We're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Casting Commons Football here on RTC TV4. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Ten minutes left in the half. LaVille stopping to talk about what they're going to do in this fourth down situation. Given the quality of their defense... Well, they, they may be going for field goal attempt is up and short. That was a healthy kick. It was definitely uh, windage was accurate on that. Just didn't quite have the distance behind it. Yeah. So they didn't lose anything. That makes no sense. They should be getting the ball from the... That's high school rules, man. Okay. 
All right, Comets take possession on their own 20. Fresh set of downs. Routabush finds the hole, keeps his feet. Can't quite move the chains, but great gain of yardage on that play. Comments will be second and one. Excuse me while I fix my scoreboard. Ball on their own 29 yard line. Fakes the handoff. Molenkoff looks like he's going to get enough to move the chains. There the chains move. Comets really seem to have been able to ignite a fire here. Uh, starting late in the first quarter couple of really good plays help them to realize that they, they've got the they've got the personnel right Routabush ball carrier there looks like he just made it back to the line of scrimmage Comments under 10 seconds. They definitely have to watch their clock management. Monkoff, short pass is complete to Routabush. And he's going to be good for a first down. Comets with now with the ball on their own 42-yard line, making a concerted charge towards the Lancers' territory. Ball back in the hands of Routabush. He breaks one tackle. Gets held. I think they had him by the face mask, but I don't see any canaries on the field. It's like second and five. Ball on the 46 yard line. Up through the middle, Yarber gets stopped at the line of scrimmage. Number seven, Jabez, Yarber in the top area. Tackle by number 14, Xavier Lafay. Hand off there to Routabush. He's still upright, but he gets met at the line of scrimmage. Takes comments to a fourth and five situation. <coughs> By this point, the Lancers kind of have Routabush's number. Molenkoff flicks it over to Routabush. Routabush breaks one tackle. Gain of a couple yards, but unfortunately not enough to move the chains. 
LaVille, just under half of the quarter to go, takes possession on their own 49-yard line. There's a snap, couple of tackles broken, and Yarber stops that run at the, about the Comets 35 yard line. There's the pass, pass tipped by Kyle Routebush. And he takes it clear back to the Lancers 40 yard line. Huge play there by the senior, Kyle Routebush. Comet six yards into Lancer's territory. Fresh set of downs and a fire in their belly. Jabez Yarber able to trim a couple of yards. Comments with only six seconds on the play clock. Definitely don't need to get hit with a delay of game penalty. Oh, and Molenkoff tackled behind the line. Great O-line penetration there by that defense. Brings Comets to a, a third and 11 situation. Oh, Molenkoff had a lot of time in the pocket, couldn't quite make a decision. Tackled very far back. Fourth in a parking lot now. Comet staring at fourth and 18 with the ball now in their own territory. And LaVille will use their second time out of the night. We're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Casting Comments Football here on RTC TV. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen.
Kick is up. Got some air underneath it. It'll land on the LaVille 30. Roll just a few more. Lancer with three and a half minutes on the clock. Taking possession on their own 26 yard line. Plummer will hand it off. Well, we're going to get the chains to move. Routabush and Yarber bring down the ball carrier on the Comets 25 yard line. That was uh, Cody Allen with that carry. Just a few steps away from running away with it. Plummer under center, fakes the handoff, drops back into the comments, or the pocket when he's met by a host of comments. Petrie Duvall making that tackle. Lancers now second and 18 on the Comets 38 yard line. Thank you. Allen will carry it again. Gets tripped up by the shoelaces there. Grant Yaden makes it nearly back to the original line of scrimmage. Lancers third and 18 now. Or excuse me, third and 11. Allen tackled at the line of scrimmage by Kyle Routabush. Lancers fourth and 10 on the Comets 30 yard line. This Comets defense has really come alive in the second quarter. Are they going for a field goal here? <laughs> and Caston to use their last time out there. Possibly in an attempt to ice the kicker. Well, I say that and I believe the ref indicated that was LaVille's timeout. Anyway, we're going to step away. We're going to thank our sponsors. You're watching Cast and Comments Football here on RTC TV 4. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, correction. That was a Lancer timeout, so certainly they're not icing their own kicker. There's the snap. Kick is up. And that's good. All right, just under 90 seconds left here in the half. Comets will receive the kickoff after this timeout here on RTC TV. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. After that, Pretty impressive, 42, 45-ish yard field goal uh, kick just before the commercial break. 
Yarber and Yaden back to receive deep in the backfield for the Comets. And Plummer coming up for the boot. It's up. It's deep. Yaden, great tackle breaks there. Still looking and gets across the 50 before being taken out of bounds. Very impressive kickoff return there by Grant Yaden. Yaden pushed out of bounds at the Lancers' 42-yard line. Just over a minute and a quarter on the game clock. Molenkoff, he'll keep it. How about I reset these downs? Gain of about five on that. And again, how about I fix it down? Second and five. Ball's in the air. Overshoots the receiver. Fortunately, also overshoots the defenders. Comets third and five. Ball still on the Lancers 37 yard line. Just under a minute left here in the half. We're under 10 seconds on the play clock. Comet's got to snap it. There we go. Molenkoff puts it in the air. Two defenders. Defenders receiver, none of them can get under it. Comets fourth and five on the Lancers 37. 48 seconds left in the half. Molenkoff looking for a receiver. Finds nobody. He'll keep it. And tackled right around the line of scrimmage. There is a flag on the field. That was a hold against the Comets. Penalty declined. Lancers will take over at their own 37-yard line. 42 seconds left in this half. Which can be an eternity depending on how the ball is moved. Short pass is good. Tackled out of bounds right at the 50 yard line. That'll be enough to move the chains. Plummer looking for the receiver, sends it long. 
Pass is good. Tackled out of bounds. Right around the 10 yard line. Six. LaVille now, first and goal, six to go. Just under 27 seconds left to fight their way into the Comets end zone. Plummer puts it in the air and pass will be complete. Puts LaVille at 29 to zero. See if they line up for a two point conversion to make up for that missed PAT earlier. And no, the kicking tee is out. And the kick is up between the uprights. So that will put LaVille at 30 to zero with 19 seconds left in the half. We'll be back. Thank our sponsors here on RTC TV4. Kickoff gonna be clear back into the end zone for the touchback. Bounces off the flagpole. My guess is the Comets are going to knee it out. Go ahead and go into the locker room. So at halftime here at the Comet Crater, that'll be LaVille 30, Caston 0. Now stay tuned. I believe that we do have, that the cheerleaders have a presentation today. That They've had their elementary cheer camp this week. So I'm gonna go to uh, I'm gonna go to Crowd Mike and and uh, pick up the exterior uh, audio for that, and then we will step away for our our halftime advertising. We want to thank our sponsors, and of course we want to thank you for being with us here tonight. Uh, you're watching Cast and Comets football here on RTC TV4.
Keeping them out, keeping them 
Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. The comments will kick off to start the second half. Of course, the Lancers currently just one visit from the end zone to taking this to a running clock second half. Ooh, that return bumbled and a big hit to back deep for the Comets. Grant Yaden with that tackle. Comments defense with a big second quarter looking to keep that intensity up as they go here into the third. <clears throat> Ball carrier Allen finds a couple of big holes able to break a couple of tackles before finally being brought down at the 44 yard line. It'll be enough to move the chains though. Give the Lancers another set of downs. Plummer back, fakes the handoff. Slant route, that pass is good. Caught by the fingertips. I don't think it's quite enough to move the, the chains. Pass caught there by LaFay. Looks like it was about eight yards. <clears throat> Lancer second and two. On the Comets 47 yard line. Another faked handoff. Plummer is going to keep it. Finds a hole. He'll move the chains and then some. Steps out of bounds at about the Comets 35 yard line. Plummer with a pass that was tipped. Oh, Yarber holding a leg. I don't know if he was just aggravated that he couldn't quite cover up the fumble. Lancers now second and one with the ball on the 26 yard line. Allen will move the chains in a little more. Allen, the ball carrier, tackled by number 19, Kyle Routabush. Routabush with that tackle there. Lancers now just outside the red zone. Plummer looking to put it in the air. No, yes, he will. And pass is complete into the end zone. <clears throat> and with only two and a half minutes gone off the clock, we are now in a running clock second half. Nice 
Ball in the tee. It's up and no good. Kyle Routabush getting that block. And so, eight minutes and 40 seconds left here in the third quarter. We're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Cast and Comments Football here on RTC TV4. Teams taken to the field for this kickoff. All right, Plummer kicking off for the Lancers. Ball is up and deep. It will be a touchback. Grant Yaden with that carry. It's tackled by his shoelaces. A gain of about four. Fake the handoff. Yaden keeps it. He'll move the chains. Chase Ang got there, the ball carrier. Football pops free. I believe it was after the tackle, though. Looks like second and four for the Comets here. With the ball on their 41 yard line. <clears throat> Anga goes to the right. Not sure. They might have to bring the chains out and measure that. I'm going to call this third and inches. <clears throat> Yaden goes up the middle, moves the chains, keeps going. Big gain of yardage there. Down, 
Just passing the five minute mark here in the third quarter. Landon Rigney carrying that ball. It's like second and six. Ball on the 41 yard line. Oh, pass is incomplete there. Third and six, still sitting on the 41-yard line. Yaden in the gun, fakes the handoff to Angot, and pass is tipped. Pass is incomplete. Yaden, a little fortunate there that nobody could get underneath that. Fourth and six, ball in the Lancers 41. Just under three minutes left here in the third quarter. <coughs> Snap nearly goes wild. Yaden though takes advantage of the gap in the line. I think he's gonna move those chains. Chain gang is moving. That's good for a Comets first down. Handed off to Routabush. Routabush lowers his head, dives into three defenders, and he'll move the yard marker. Looks like we're about second down, seven yards to go. Ball on the Lancers 28 yard line. With a minute and a half left here in the third, there's the snap. Hand off to Angot. He goes up the middle, gets tackled at the line of scrimmage. Handed back to Angot, he goes to the right, and we've got a flag on this play. Looks like they're motioning that the flag is or the penalty is against the comments. That was a holding call against the comments. Puts the comments at about third and 14. 
Oh. Oh. Yaden loses his footing as he goes to plant and pass. And we have a Lancer down holding his shin. Well, we're going to step away uh, and thank our sponsors as we roll into the third quarter or the fourth quarter at the end of three. It's LaVille 36, Caston 0. We'll be back after this word from our sponsors here on RTC TV 4. All right. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Comments now at about a fourth and 19 situation on the Lancers 39 yard line. Oh, high snap is bumbled around. Yaden tries to go with it, gets tackled well back into Comets territory. Man, it looks like we've got Levi Martin down on the field. Big tackle there by Kyle Roudebush. And that was Connor Amore with the ball and probably quite the headache now. Ball is in the air and passed just ahead of the intended receiver. Laville now on their own 49 yard line, third down. Plummer drops back, puts the ball in the air again, passes incomplete to number two, Cole Stafford. Oh, excuse me, I can't read. <laughs> that was number two, Colin Sarnacki. Plummer puts it in the air again and passes incomplete. And they will turn over on downs on their own 49 yard line. Handoff there to number 16, Landon Rigney. And he makes some big gain there. Rigney taking the ball clear down to the Lancers 25 yard line. And off again to Rigney. He manages to get out of a hold there. Moves the ball forward to about the 15-yard line. And that'll be good for another Comets first down. Comets now 
on the Lancers 13 yard line. I think this is the furthest into the red zone. They've made it here tonight. Yaden puts it in the hands of Kyle Raudabush. Raudabush behind his blockers. Manages to get free and he makes it into the end zone. That'll be a touchdown Comets. Comets lined up to attempt a field goal. High snap. Oh, no, they're going to fake it. And Grant Yaden tripped up on the two-yard conversion attempt. So with just over uh, half of the fourth quarter left to be played, Comets breaking that goose egg, getting up on the board. It is now 36-6. The advantage is to LaVille, but you're watching Cast of Comets football here on RTC TV 4. Gavin Molenkoff lined up to kick for the Comets. <clears throat> Deep kick picked up by Allen at about the five yard line. Tackled by a host of Comets up at around the 17 yard line. Do have one comment slow to get up here. <laughs> Levi Martin on, off the field under his own power. He is limping pretty bad, though. Comets chasing down the ball carrier, finally push him out of bounds at about the 26 yard line. Number four, Cole Stafford, the ball carrier, pushed out of bounds by number 72, Petrie Duvall. Pete Duvall with that shove out of bounds. Lancers at second and one on their own 26 yard line. Just over five minutes left to play here tonight. A little bit of a flea flicker in the backfield. And the ball carrier losing his footing. He goes down for a loss of yards. Number 12, Connor Amore, the ball carrier. Lavelle now third and three. Ball on the 24-yard line. Lateral pass and goes down 
right at the chain marker. It's like the officials are saying that was good enough for a Lancer's first down. <coughs> Ball making its way to the 27 yard line. Just over four minutes left to play here tonight. Ball carrier tackled just past the line of scrimmage. It's like about a gain of two. Kyle Routabush with that tackle. He's been a huge asset at every point on the field here tonight. Of course, he had that pick. He's had a lot of big offensive plays, responsible for moving the chains on more than one occasion, not to mention some big tackles on the defensive side of the ball. Handoff, great read there by number 79, Brody Brewer. Tackle for a big loss of yards. Laville now third and 13. Ball on their own 25 yard line. Fakes the handoff. Quarterback tries to keep it. The referees will blow that dead. Stop a motion. A loss of another two yards. Fourth and 15 now. Lancers deep in their own territory. And we just passed the two minute warning here. Winding down tonight at the crater. <laughs> and timeout Lancers. We're going to step away and thank our sponsors. You're watching Casting Comments Football here on RTC TV 4. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. The Lancers are in punt formation. Plumber back deep to punt. Sends her whizzing end over end. Yarber grabs it on the bounce. Brings it back across midfield for being tackled out of bounds at the Lancers 38 yard line. Just over a minute left on the game clock here tonight. Comets first and 10 on the Lancers 37 yard line. Brigney breaking one tackle, brought down at about the 29 yard line. One of these days I'll remember to stay on these downs and yards to go. Today is not that day. 20 seconds left in the game. Rigney will move the chains. And we're under 10 seconds on the game clock. And teams are going to line up and shake hands. Ladies and gentlemen, your final score here tonight from the crater. 
is LaVille 36, cast in six. We want to thank you so much for joining us here this evening. I'm Blair Zimmerman. We had uh, Carson Harness up on the cameras, and we'll see you next time here on RTC TV4. Good night. Yeah.